18 years ago today, Lori Paestawa was killed in Iraq, becoming the very first Native American woman to die in combat. As her family does every year, they gathered once again at Paestawa Peak, renamed in her honor to celebrate her life and legacy. I would want people to always remember her smile and the fact that she loved life. Lori Paestawa's mom, Percy, knows the importance of her daughter's legacy. On our journey, we will face many obstacles and hardships, but by the sacrifices of our veterans, we will be able to find the courage to rise above the obstacles and hardships. After Lori's death, then Governor Janet Napolitano led the charge to rename Paestawa Peak after her. The name that was on the mountain was a derogatory name to the Native American people. I'm very humbled, very honored that the mountain was named after her. And we always tell people that it's doesn't just represent Lori, it doesn't just represent the Paestuba name, it represents all veterans and all those who have served. And just recently, the city of Phoenix renamed a street East Paestuba Peak Drive. Today, Mayor Kate Gallego surprised Lori's mom with her very own street sign. To thank you all for all you have done to make this a stronger community. That was amazing, that was, I did not expect that. Ken koshio has been drumming at Paestoa Peak almost every day for an entire year. So meaningful to honor the history of this family's service and sacrifice. A lot of, you know, people who, you know, in, who are in service and then dedicate their life to save this country, I really respect. <laughs> 